see if I can do that. I might do some more exploring of this uh, area later. Because of how difficult the enemies are right now, I think it's Before better to happens. progress. How's that story end? Odin's spear had spilled the lifeblood of Emir, the first giant. A necessary evil, he would say, to bring order to the realms. With Emir's torn flesh, Odin would fashion the realm of Midgard for his own. Call himself all father as if he was the creator and not the creator's destroyer. This small, covetous tyrant. Emir? Huh? Oh. Sorry, my boy. Uh, you know, I think at best we just end it there, actually. I might need to go around just looking for uh, those drops. What's that down there? Because I keep finding them. Lumir, what can you tell me about that giant lady with the boat? She was called Skadi, Queen of the Hunt. Her father was Theotzi, who could there. take the shape of any wild creature and taught Skadi how to hunt them all. From the ribs of pack beasts, she fashioned second feet, allowing her to glide upon the snow so no animal could evade her. She became a huntress beyond compare, even to any god. Odin himself wanted her for his bride, believing she would bear him strong sons. But she spurned his affections. And for that insult, Odin vowed revenge. It was put forth that the Aesir were plagued by an eagle who would steal the precious golden apples of Edun. Not even the finest archer among the gods could bring it down. Odin knew that Skadi could not resist the temptation to prove herself superior. And so she joined the hunt. Skadi tracked the eagle as it flew where she alone could glide, and loosed an arrow from her unerring bow. When she collected her quarry, she found no eagle at all. But her own father, poor Fiozzi, slain by his own daughter. She was overcome with grief and shame. For there is nothing nature so reviles as a child who kills their parent. Skadi succumbed to her fate as winter's blanket fell, holding her father as the mountain held her in an embrace to last eternity. Well, that was sad. There aren't many happy endings for the giants, I'm afraid. I'm mostly trying to get all these, uh, these things, the drops. I guess I keep finding, uh, uh, the gold, too. Another one for strength. Wow, it's like there was an entire city under the water. Hi, lad. A forgotten city. What was it called? Now, uh, well, I forgot. Oh, there's another one now. Cool down. That's an interesting gate. I wonder who built it. Alright, I'm pretty sure I've made a complete circle now. I don't think there's gonna be much more. Yeah, it looks like those bones that I saw before. Alright, so I might have missed one or two, but I think I'm good. So I'm gonna head Yeah, I got that one. 
I'm gonna go ahead and head in here. This looks like the will lead me uh to that side quest. Here it is over. Land Southern Canyon Canyon. seems off too. There we go. But yeah, I'm definitely heading in the right direction. So, I was right in thinking that there was a passage uh, there. I heard it after I jumped down. To this here ring. Uh, what? I can't hear thoughts from rings, bro. It's talking to me. It's in Vari. Ha! Knew it. He says he went to the Velander mines to observe his mistake, but then the Soul Eater attacked. So as he was being ripped apart, he cast a spell that removed his soul and put in this ring. And then he. What about all his stuff? Uh, huh? Andari had a workshop here with all sorts of posh doodads and ornatory tools. And one beaut of a hammer. He make mention of it still in there? Uh, you're upsetting him. Your point? You fellas take Andari with you and go have a look-see. If you find his hammer, I'll whip up something real nice for you. Hey now, don't go forgetting your entry stone. Yeah. Okay. Before I do that, let's sort you out. New armor already. Not as good as what I have right now. That's okay. Uh. Go ahead and replace this again. Now about that other thing. Invari isn't happy about us taking his stuff. I do not care. I'm not gonna tell him that. Also the heal, which luckily there's one right here. Enemies. I'm set. Focus up. 
There. How do I do? I see improvement. And Vari says this dwarf was part of his crew. That he died because of his mistakes. He sounds sad. The ring's grief is of little importance, boy. <laughs> Just destroy everything. Alright, so I obviously have to... Use that lever. I don't know if it'll open that. Or if it'll lower that. Well, it's probably to lower this. Or to just freaking drop that. warning us not to go down there stop listening to the ring boy he cannot be trusted there is a s switch in there I might be, it might be something that I just come around to um, what? What was that? The hell? What disconnected? I didn't do much back then. So the I'm <laughs> on the computer disconnected. I don't know what it was. But um why are the dark elves here? Yeah. 
I mean, I kind of figured that I would see them again. Uh, they wouldn't be just in Alfheim. It's that ring boy. 